Primordial Electrophysics. Why do we need to build a Large Hadron Collider if any student who knows the fundamentals of the primordial electrophysics can make absolutely accurate calculations of interaction of elementary particles under any conditions on his tablet? It would be much more humane to allocate these huge amounts of money which are spent on expensive research for the real help to people in need, considering how many people in the world today have to live below poverty level. Thanks to the primordial electrophysics, humanity can make an evolutionary change in science as physics is the basis of all natural sciences. The primordial electrophysics allows us to conduct qualitatively new research works and make discoveries in different scientific areas, make exact calculations practically without expenditures. Certainly, this evolutionary knowledge makes it possible to develop any scientific disciplines qualitatively and in a new way, to make breakthroughs in quantum physics, biophysics, chemical physics, geophysics, astrophysics, and so on. Research works in these scientific areas based on the knowledge of the primordial electrophysics have already brought tremendous results including those in the sphere of studying of new technologies for production and obtaining inexhaustible energy. The knowledge of the primordial electrophysics gives access to an inexhaustible source of energy, which is everywhere, including outer space. It is renewable energy, thanks to which elementary particles are created, move, and interact. The ability to get it and to transfer it from one state to another gives us a source of alternative energy, new, safe, and available to each person. The potential of this never-ending source of energy is huge. It is much bigger and much more stable and safer than the potential of the sun or geothermal energy. Moreover, using this source, we do not need any longer to accumulate excessive energy and transfer it to the consumer for further use. Because this energy is everywhere, it can become available to each person under any conditions, here and now, both on Earth and in space. Certainly, it will qualitatively change the life of human civilization in general. Nuclear power plants will disappear as unnecessary Oil, gas, and other known power sources will lose their relevance due to high labor intensity of production, storage, exhaustibility of these resources, and their environmental hazard. The use of the inexhaustible source of energy will lead not only to reduction of emissions of harmful gases in the atmosphere, but to utilization of the whole production cycle. Thanks to qualitatively new opportunities, of receiving necessary life-supporting, ready-made products. For humanity, it opens up a possibility of absolutely new way of life, in which such things as need, hunger, will disappear, and people will not need to work hard to make a living. People will have more free time. Consumer market will disappear as unnecessary, because each person will be able to make anything on his own food, clothes, house, car, for free and in any quantity required. In such conditions, it is possible for the civilization to make a qualitatively new transition to spiritual self-development, large-scale scientific study of the world. But there is also a danger that such discoveries may be used for egoistical purposes. It is known that disadvantages or advantages of any epochal discoveries depend on the domination of this or that worldview of the majority, selfish, consumer, or spiritual and creative vector of thinking. 